Last weekend I went to the Orange Blossom Concha Dance weekend. And this weekend I'm going to the Snowball. And I thought I needed a lot of power. So I did disconnect my AGM battery from the Kodiak. And I have been able to to get it up to 13 volts which is 100% um, power that's what I wanted to do and that's what I'm doing I'm looking for my little chart so um, I just used it to do to vacuum clean my area here here's the vacuum cleaner So under the vacuum cleaner, the voltage drops down to 11.4. But over the vacuum cleaner, it it will rise up to 12.5. And 12.5 is 80%, much better than before. The Kodiak would only only raise it to 80%, and then it would drop down. As I used it, and now I started at 13.05, 13, 13 which was 100%, and I went down to 12.5. It's saying 12.4 now because I just turned it on. But, you know, 12.4, 12.5, 75%, how's that? So, uh, much better. And what I did is I connected the uh, I connected the uh, solar controller to the solar panels and uh, I got a 2000 watt inverter with a peak 3000 watt so that should take care of my 10 amp vacuum cleaner which I will be trying out but I had the 8 amp easily convenient, so I used it and I vacuum cleaned this area. So the AGM battery is all by itself, has its own inverter, and has its own solar controller. By the way, I do not rec if you guys see the name of it, I do not recommend this controller. And and the reason is because I had to reset it. And once once uh, once a device has to be reset, indication there's something wrong with with the device. The Kodiak solar generator, although I stressed it to hell, and I work it super hard, I've never had to reset it. Well, I had to reset when I put it into safety mode, but but that that's that's operator error. But this thing, this this controller went by itself. It was charging happy as can be. The next time I looked at it, it was dead to the world. So, so just 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 so you could see, the, the Kodiak solar generator is continuously being used by me. Although I have the AGM for hard work, the Kodiak solar, solar generator is constantly working hard. Okay? And I think you guys have seen it. One of these connections is this... This... Uh, 300 watt panel, which... I use it to connect to computers and I have this is this is the that 12 volt fan that I I have and one thing nice about this controller is that I can charge up my cell phone 
the one I'm using now, so it's 100% charged. And I don't have to turn this on to, to charge it. So I am using the best of what each system has. And tomorrow I'm going to go to the snowball, the Florida snowball. And when I do that, I'll disconnect this on the solar panel. I'll connect it to the car. And by the time I get to the dents, this should be up to, to uh, you guys can't see it. This should be back up to... Um, 12.5 it's not 12.12 12.21 by the way this is another phone and it's in theory supposed to be better than my other phone but it has a hard time much more hard time focusing than the other phone I don't know what I did with the other phone it's somewhere in the van I'll find it but right now when I'm transitioning from 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 one mode to another, I went to the dance. I visited some friends. I just got back. I had the cell phone, my other cell phone, at the, my friend's house. I assume it's in the van. Could be there. I don't know. And. Uh, That's 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 the way I'm gonna run it. Two different separating two two different battery systems in each uh, each uh, independent of the other. And now I can get this up to one hundred percent. Why not something brand new? Anyway, so um, I told you guys I was going to do it. I did it. And uh, I will be still doing some, some detailed work on the Kodiak generator, which is my main power source. If I would have used it on the vacuum cleaner except for the fact that I know that tomorrow I'm going to be connecting the Kodiak to the car. When I connect the Kodiak to the car, the AGM battery is going to be getting the full energy from the solar panel and, and, and I wanted to drain it down a bit so it, somewhere the energy would go and that's what I did.